So this is it. It's very sad. Our last morning at Cinca Exotica. This is from our bathroom. I'm really sad to be leaving. But it's also the first day that I'm able to say I get to see our beautiful girls in the morning. So that is a very good thing. I'm gonna take a look at our little area before we take off. So when we come up from our path, I don't know how far down that is. Michael will have to tell you. But then we come off the path here to our little area called Mango. Look at that beautiful view from up here. Oh. And we come up, checking for snakes, of course. We were two for two on the first two days. And this is our bathroom hut that I just came out of. Not too shabby, huh? We got a working sink and a working toilet. And that is it. <laughs> but it's been wonderful. And then come down our path. Oh, still with a beautiful view. And this is our hut that we sleep in. But we'll go check out the shower first. I'm gonna come over here to the right. This is the part I will miss the most. This is our shower. Right here, we just come right down these rocks and hang our towel on these and there is our shower um, no there's no hot water but look at where you're showering that's right right out here looking at the ocean <laughs> and sometimes our little jungle friends come to join us there were white faced monkeys over here one day. But yeah, this is our our own private little paradise here. Yep, look. Hibiscus flowers. So now we run up. And don't worry, it's completely private. No one can see us over here. <laughs> to our hut has a little bit of protection from rain coming in at the top and that is about the extent of the protection that we, <laughs> we have. I see someone. Hi, hi baby. He's reading. <laughs> so we come in. Video. Yeah. Okay, here's our mosquito net. Shut the door so nothing comes. We have a mosquito net around oh, around the bed, which has been pretty good. But if you see this huge hole next to where I sleep, <laughs> we still get some uh, bugs in here at night. Hi, baby. We put a blanket over the pillows because it just stays so damp in here. It's not very comfortable. I had a little fan last night, which is like the best night's sleep I've had. Yes, when Colleen and Anthony left, they gave us this fan and 20 pounds of batteries. <laughs> so they didn't have to pay for it on the little plane home. And then... We have this little area over here to put our stuff in. 
which is mostly all dirty laundry. <laughs> Everything is wet. Once it's wet, it pretty much stays wet. And all this wood, you have to check for red ants and stuff before you put anything down. Our boots should be dry. Well, Michael's amazing boots are already dry. Mine, not so much. But they should be good by tomorrow. And then they gave us candles and told them pretty much don't light them. <laughs> so we have our flashlights we take everywhere. We get two little chairs and somewhere to hang stuff. And this. This is right out our window. This morning, Michael said a hummingbird came in while I was still sleeping. It's pretty neat. Somewhere right there, that's the um, yoga platform below us. That's got some pretty awesome views too. Can't say we did much of that while we were here, but I'm sure it was fun. Yep. We're gonna miss this place. 